Fall in Tennessee. The crisp, cool morning air. The trees painted with colored leaves. Hello, pumpkins. Hello, harvest. The pumpkin spice lattes are flowing. It really shows you how beautiful it is to let things go. And because you know, in just a few short months, spring will be back and the cycle will start all over again. And you welcome the change. The changing leaves are a reminder of the constant that's always around us. What do you think? Huh? What do you think of your leaves? You're so funny, huh? Do you like the leaves? Don't eat them. Probably don't taste good. Don't act like you wouldn't do it. It's kind of fun just to fall into the leaves, you know? Whew. Um, yeah, so yeah, it's about that time where it's nice. It's annoying to pick up leaves. I mean, you could leave them there. <laughs> yeah, good one. Not do anything about them, which we've been over this before. You could leave them and they make great mulch, do all kinds of stuff, but I don't know. All these trees were about halfway done. So we try to clean up as, as much as we can about halfway through. That way you don't have to deal with all of it. And especially with Bryn's new little, like, yard, if you want to call it that. what you think, Bryn? No more leaves. It's kind of hard to get them out of here, so. A little bit, a little bit of a process, but uh, what do you think? Made some good damage, though. Uh, got the leaves out there in a pile, um, just for the kids to have some fun with them playing. You mean you? The, the leaves aren't bad. If you take the mower and you mow over them and then you mow back over them, it mulches them very good. I mean, you could use, you can mow straight and kind of blow them out that way and get them out to a place where you don't want them. And then once you start mowing over them, just go backwards over them and it'll mulch them up into a fine, smaller leaf. And it's, you know, it's gone in a, in a couple of weeks. So, uh, but that's about it. It's gorgeous. It's 80, it is 81 today. And then tomorrow we go to 60 and Tuesday, Wednesday, I think we drop in the 50s with lows in the upper 20s, 27. So the lows right now are like 50s, 60s, which is fantastic. But Tuesday, Wednesday, we got some Arctic air coming down and it's gonna get darn cold. But then we're going right back up. So, cause fall's, fall's the best. Fall is absolutely the best. You say that about everything. That's why I get like people that wanna jump into Christmas and decorate and everything. It's like, you get so into Christmas and then Christmas comes and then everyone's depressed. Everyone's like, oh my God, I want it to be warmer. Oh, I want it. like, and you miss this. Like you miss this awesome part of the year, Halloween and Thanksgiving and just, this is the best part. And you guys skip over this and you go straight to Christmas. Drives me nuts. Your heart's an empty heart. I love Christmas just like anybody else does. But it's like, why? It's like people that like speed to work. It's like, why, why are you speeding to work? Like, we don't want to go to work. Why are you in a rush to get there, right? Slow down, enjoy it, pump the brakes. Let's take it as it comes. So we'll see what these, uh, I mean, this is already, you saw what it looked like earlier. We cleaned it. It's already had some leaves fall. This will be covered, I assume, by the end of day today, if not tomorrow. Um, Cause you got, we got a cold front coming in, 10 to 15 mile per hour wind. So it's just gonna, just like these little breezes coming in right now. It'll knock the rest of these things off, but we still got we still got green on some of these things that need to color up a little bit. So where's my ball? You're already raking again. No, well, we're making the little dog. But we just cleaned all these this morning. I know. Now we gotta clean them again. And there's still more. Are you working on a little dog pile? On the pink. All right, Babs wants to go for a little walk. A little fall walk. 
a nice little yeah. walk because it's our nice last nice day Wednesday for a little bit. It's gonna be chilly. Are you gonna wear? Are you gonna get out your cold weather clothes? No, I'll probably just wear pants and a rain jacket, and I'll be alright. I'm in. So I'm inside. Okay, so Cause I feel like it's it. not yet to make the switch. You got to make a switch when you have seasons, which is something you know we never had, so we didn't have to worry about. It. But as you come out here and you start to have seasons and you have different clothes and you put them in buckets up in the attic or in the garage and then you gotta bust out your summer stuff or your winter stuff or you gotta switch out it's so it's almost time to switch out but not yet almost because i feel like we still got 70s we still got some good days coming for november we're end of october so i think we still got some we don't want to get crazy not yet not uggs not yet those are all seed pods. Those are wild. Holy smokes. It looks like you can make it in. Looks like a big old crushed red pepper. Sheesh. But there's nothing in that. No? No peas or beans or? These are black walnuts. Don't if you break them open. You gotta be careful because they're nasty. But there you go. There's your walnut. Really annoying. The kids love to throw them. But if you have those trees, those are those trees are worth money. People sell those things. And you can, hey, look at here. There's a good one right here. That one's already been kind of smashed. He's got a three black walnuts. Y'all seen any good movies lately? Never heard that one before. That whole hill is really cool in springtime. All different colored trees. You get white, pink, all kinds. It's almost turkey season. Get us some Thanksgiving dinner. There is a bag. It's right there. See that? like a skull or something. This could go bad. Dude, that thing has some teeth. Whatever it is. It looks like a dog. Dude, that is gnarly. It's definitely a dog or something. Oh, That's crazy. Somebody just threw their dog up there? Look at those chompers, man. Woo. Why do y'all always give me that look? You got beef or something? <sighs> yes, yes, this is the best part. You said that. Literally. My favorite part with fall because it starts to cool off in the evenings and then you just get a little fire pit going. And it is money. Endless firewood. You can have endless fire pits. It's perfect. It's perfect. You already eat this morning like you did last time. Is this your favorite part of the bonfire? Sexy right there. <laughs> I know my favorite part. What are you doing back there? Are you eating one too? Mm hmm. Mace, you eating a s'more? We're sharing, huh? No one eats them as good as I do. I just make them last. Babs found those, uh, the mallows that are like squares. Like they literally fit on the entire graham cracker. But they tend to be a little much. <laughs> Sometimes. That's good debate. How do y'all like your mallows? Then you roast the mallow. Raw, lightly toasted, golden brown, black, blackened, <laughs> blackened mahi mahi style like Mackenzie. But there's different levels to blacken too. Like, do you just come out the gate and just blacken it so it's still no, you gotta cook it. not melty, or do you cook it and cook then it blacken? And then burn it. So cook it and then black it. Like, I think if you go golden brown rotisserie yeah. and then you just put a little crust on it 
that's the way to do a malo properly. But it's up for opinion, you know? It's however you like it. So. I don't know, but YouTube people or Instagram people are probably like, how does he always do her so dirty? I'm not doing you dirty. Did you not see my face? It's just how you eat a s'more. With my dog wearing it. <laughs> Is that graham cracker on her head? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Female being, show us the sheep. Started to pick up the scraps. 